just want to uh, emphasize the significance of this relationship. Uh, as you know, uh, Malaysian government has always promoted um, new industries, high value added uh, activities. Um, Malaysia and Japan are two large trading partners and we've seen a lot of investments in the manufacturing sector historically. But today is significant because Harukawa is in the content creation space and they have selected all over in Malaysia as a hub. This is, this is the significance of this uh, relationship. Just now that Uti Idris mentioned, the total market for content is a 10 trillion US dollar market. But if you, that's the total one right, with film, animation, content. But if you look at the space that Kadokawa explained, according to a PwC report, it is a USD 1.6 trillion market, uh, which consists of book publishing, magazine publishing, video games, and mobile apps. So they are actually playing in a very, very big space. So this hub here is very significant because during the speeches you heard that they are creating content not just for the local market but also for the regional market, the Southeast Asian market as well as the Middle East market. And the export, the, the value of this relationship first of all is between a world class company from Japan together with our local company. You imagine the kind of content that they can create the intellectual property that they are going to create, the jobs, the high skill jobs that they are going to create, and also the export, potential export value. We cannot give you a number, but it is a huge potential. So I, I appeal to you to, to help us to amplify and write this story because sometimes we are always asked the question, you know, what is the value of bringing a multinational to invest here? What's the value to our local uh, talent?